Chase Harlan with Home Redevelopment Solutions, and I'm here with Enrique and Gaynell. Hello, you probably, you guys probably know. This is you probably know Gaynell. Surely you do. Everybody knows yeah, Gaynell in Arlington, <laughs> right? Um, sure. Yeah. So another one of our exciting kitchen refreshes. Although this one's quite different because we actually didn't do an entire kitchen refresh. What did we do? You want to tell us some of what we did? Well, you guys did a masterful job of replacing the countertop with this beautiful homed. Check Via it out. Lactia Granite. Ooh, lovely SGI. granite. What is it called? From SGI. Okay. Yes. And that's actually just outside of Irvington, right here on Emerson. Yeah. Right, South yeah. Emerson. Mm -hmm. Check them out. They're great. Awesome. And um, also did a new stovetop. Check this out. Look at that cooktop. Yay. Mm -hmm. And a pop up vent oh yeah so this is going to be really cool when this we get this like fancy thing going age. yeah this is actually a uh, downdraft they call it a downdraft pop-up vent uh, so when we get that uh, connected it's actually going to pop up and actually will pull all of the heat and all of the uh, what steam really from the mm -hmm. stove um, out and then also over here what do we do Reglaze. yeah check it out the old porcelain sinks okay you can't get porcelain anymore hardly. there you go so and we... last but not least mm -hmm. The new coffee. Oh, bar. check it out! Coffee bar, coffee bar. Woo! -hoo -hoo. Enrique sitting in the new coffee area. Put some new lights on the wall over there, yep. um, and put a new light up here. Look at that, gorgeous. So, hey, if you don't have uh, what you think would be an entire kitchen refresh, but you have a few updates, we'd love to talk to you about that. Enrique, wouldn't you? <laughs> don't forget the new faucets. Did you see Enrique? He was like, spot what? <laughs> don't forget the new faucets. Oh, yeah. And, so, and, and new the faucets. reverse osmosis. Oh, look at that. Look at that. And the reverse osmosis. Tell us about that. What's that? Clean water. Yeah, it's important. It's super purifier. important. purifier. Yeah. So, so for you, you have reverse osmosis for drinking water. Yes. And then you would use that when necessary for some of your food prep or whatever, exactly. right? Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Um, but mostly you have it on this sink, right? We were originally going to do it on both sinks, but we actually right. chose just to do it there, yeah. right? Yeah. And so what I will say is these guys are the bomb. They're oh, fantastic. Oh, that's really awesome. That's awesome. And they have been super communicative, super thorough, super pro proactive, oh, that's awesome. and super... Fun. Super fun. Super fun. That's important. <laughs> we appreciate you so much. Hey, one of the most important things about today that's really, really cool is we're making, what is it? El Salvadoran guacamole. El Salvadoran guacamole. Lit. Enrique is showing us the, what they, I think they should call it, I think when it comes to uh, when cuisine, they call it Salvadoran. So this Salvadoran. is Salvadoran, Salvadoran cooking, and we've got guacamole. So we're here doing, we, we traded the hammers and, and crowbars for spoons and, you know, what, what's that thing you use when you grate? A grater, grater. And a juicer. Oh, 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 juicer. and then the juicer for the yes. lime, right? Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Guacamole Estillo de Salvador. Ah, ah, guacamole Estillo de Salvador. Estillo del Salvador. Del Salvador. You think I could speak Spanish? Not yet. All right, that's Harlan and Enrique and Gaynell uh, for Home Redevelopment Solutions. We're out.